Journal entry, date unknown. And suddenly the long, uneven, thickening and thinning motion which we followed for days to some terrifying expanse of the same substance which slipped through our hands and burrowed easily into the earth, endless before us suddenly jumped up into the air unseen and immersed us standing there we tried to take cover yet still could not escape it i shivered so long i knew not would we survive one of us took on a strange chill became quiet and very hot to touch then ceased to be any more another one then began to shake and call. Overtaken by the bitter, salty substance fell out the eyes for days on end. They too would soon cease to be. The rest of us finally understood. We fell down before the mighty moving creature. We prayed, then cupped our hands around it, breaking some off from the hole though appeared unbroken, and looked at one another one last time. Then took it to the lips and raised our eyes to the sky, open pale of neck, and let the substance seep into ourselves, a most unusual feeling as it reached down into me. Further, we waited we then fell one at a time to earth and fell asleep awaiting then rose i know not when or how and smiled and embraced one another for we were still alive from this moment forward we drank and followed the uneven line of this great mysterious borderless lightness of mass, trusting, cupping it in our hands and hollowed tree limbs. It led us to verdant wonders, never before seen or known. We listened, and the sound, once frightful, was now soothing us to sleep. The air was fresh and colorful at times, and in the mornings, Sometimes, as light awakened life, we immersed ourselves entire in its cool and friendly waters still. Life would never be the same.